feeling that I'm feeling like nauseous and all that different stuff because I'm in such a compact car. <sighs> I just... Wait, what is the main thing that's, that's your concern about? It's like, it's very, very scary because like, the car is very, very... The car, hold on, the seatbelt is like, the seatbelt feels tighter than a regular seatbelt. Like, the car just feels tight. I swear I love, I know that I love her. The way she feels all on the car. The way she make it seem all on the car. Hey! Army family, your girl Brittany is back once again with another video, guys. Today's video is about to be hilarious. I need to hurry it up. Ryan had to run back upstairs because he forgot his water bottle. So, guys, we bought like these half gallon, I think they're half a gallon water bottles because we want to start like drinking. Well, I drink a lot of water, but Rayon wants to like consistently drink like a whole lot of water during the day and then top of that we've started like going to the gym and working out and stuff like that so he left his bottle upstairs so he went to go and get his bottle because guys we're literally drinking it every single day so guys i just want to show you guys something real quick you already know we have a rental and we got a camaro guys the tightness of this car is ridiculous okay this car is a compact car so I decided that today I'm going to prank Rayon. I don't know if you guys know, but I do get car sick and I also I'm very very claustrophobic. Like if I'm in a car that like the back of it goes down too far, like I'm very very claustrophobic. So me sitting in this car right now is not too bad like in the front, but if I was to have to go to the back seat, as y'all can see, there's literally no space for someone to sit. Literally. There's no space because I have to pull the chair all the way back just for me to feel comfortable. Also, guys, Rayon really likes this car, so that's the reason why we got it. And he kind of like drives, you know, you know, tests it out a bit. So, guys, I'm literally gonna try to prank him and tell him that I'm feeling like nauseous and all that different stuff because I'm in such a compact car. I don't know what I'm gonna title it yet. But I'm just going to basically be freaking out and we're just going to see his reaction. Before we get into this video, guys, make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. Make sure you turn on your post notifications every single time we drop a banger. And make sure you guys follow us on TikTok and all of our social medias. Let's go, guys. Let's get his reaction. Let's go before he comes downstairs. Let's go. All right, guys. She's on his way now. So I'm about to just get this prank started and I'm ready. A few inches later. Oh, boy. Oh, babe. I'm gonna put this damn bottle, man. That's what I'm saying. Like, where are you even gonna put that? Oh, there, right there. But when you drive, it's gonna like move. <laughs> oh man. Oh um, man, what? Like. You don't like the car? <laughs> it's like really, really compact, babe. But you know, like. You feel claustrophobic. Yeah, or like you don't claustrophobic. I need this ginger mint, babe. Oh, there's no way I'm gonna be able to take off. Oh my man. In this car. Hold on. Like, I'm driving this. I wanna be comfortable. Like you have to be comfortable because it's like it's so it's yeah, just having on jacket is not the best. It's just so tight, babe. You don't feel like claustrophobic? It is, but I thought I thought you liked this car though. How would I like the car? You were the one that wanted the car. Did you always want to drive in a Camaro though? I mean, oh, I guess you could say that, but like, now it's just like... Oh yeah, this is tight. I mean, it's not a it's family car. It's like our car. second time we're driving it. Second or third time. Because you've been in the city, baby. We both still we don't even have, to... Baby, we don't even have space in the front. How much water do you drink so far? Can you drink some water and feel okay? How about that? Like, I feel like when you went upstairs, like me just sitting here, it's like, I don't know. I'm gonna drop the top? It's too cold for that though. Oh, yeah. if, if the top could have dropped, I feel like I'd have been feeling a little bit better, but it's like, I feel like a little bit claustrophobic. Really? Um, yes, you know, I, you know I'm, I get claustrophobic. Like, look at that back seat. Just looking at that back seat scaring me. That thing is tight and we got that shovel. Why do we have the shovel in the car? It can't fit in the trunk. It can't fit in the truck. What do you want me to do? Yeah. I'm gonna be taking upstairs. It's not snowing no time soon though, so we can. Take I think it it's snowing sometime next week. This uh, week. So then we gotta keep can it we then. Just, can we just drive, please? Right, come on. 
just relax and enjoy the ride. It's just calm ride. It's like I'm really afraid because like And it's cold, that... I can't crack the window for you, baby. Or <sighs> crack it if you want to crack it. Go ahead. What do you want to do? What? Are you having a headache? Like, I, I don't know how like I just feel like really, really oh. antsy. And then Baby, you're gonna be fine. Or the car is gone. I just feel really <laughs> Wait, I feel like a little candy just fell, man. Like, I just feel real eyes because, really? like, look how tight the car is. Like, something like. It's just like a. Like. Oh, yeah, I'll drop slow. I'm going to service lane, that's what I'm going to do. Man, yeah, I'm. Like, I'm literally. I mean, I'm not going to lie to you, the car is tight, but it's not as crazy as you're making it seem, though. Come on, man. Man. Like. The car is tight. I feel claustrophobic. I feel like I can't breathe. Like I feel like there's no there's no room for me to breathe. All right, put on your jacket. I open the top. I know it's cold. We're gonna be looking at us, but if you feel a way that you gotta do what you gotta do. Come on. I feel hot. Like I feel hot. Like the car is very very claustrophobic, but like it's really really tight. Like no. What do you want to do? You want to drop a chop? All right, you want me to take it back tomorrow and get another one? Please, because like I just feel really, really claustrophobic in this car, babe. Like, you for real? Yeah, like I feel really, really claustrophobic. We'll I take it back and get another one. Let me get like a Toyota or something, some more little box here. Just, I just hey, feel really, hey, I just I'm feel down. really, really hot. Like I feel like I'm gonna. Make sure I drive slow, please. I mean, I just feel like I'm having a pot. I need my water. I need my water. I need my water. I need my water. I just feel like I'm having a pot. I can talk and I feel like... Hey, calm down. Oh my God. Hey, are you okay? No, really. Hey. Like, the car is really, really tight. Like, it's very, very compact. Calm down, babe. Come on, I'm full of water. I just... Hey, what is the main thing that's, that you're concerned about? It's like, it's very, very scary because like, the car is very, very... The, hold on, the seatbelt is like, the seatbelt feels tighter than a regular seatbelt. Like, the car just feels tight. The car is really, really tight and it's like, it's really, really scary because it's like, I don't have no space here. If someone hits us, like, it's just gonna be... Hey, babe, you know what you gotta do? Just calm down. Calm down and think straight. Calm down, please, baby. Easy on the water as well. Water is good for you, but easy on it, okay? You will choke. Hey, just calm down. You'll be fine. We'll be fine. You want to drive? You want to drive? I don't know. Maybe I'll feel better if I drive, but it's like right now I just need to calm down. But then you might panic behind the wheel, though. No. You okay? Babe, just calm down. You'll be fine. Please. Just calm down. Calm down. Tomorrow I take the car back and tell them I want another one. Four door car. Like a something. bigger car? Yes, yeah, a bigger car, yes. Because like we are like look, like look in the mirror. Like look how look how look look at look how the back is right here. Like the back is like right here on our backs. Like you'll be fine. Yeah, but it's like no type of protection. Like the car has no type of protection. Like, protection like if what? something happens, like it's just like this car is like like dangerous. The car is very, very dangerous and I don't like and it's so so fast. I just Dude, but I'm not driving fast though. I know you're not driving fast, but like the car has so much. Baby, calm down. You're just you're thinking too much. Just lay back and just relax for me, please. Please, please, please. Alright, we don't have to go anywhere today, okay? We don't have to go anywhere, I promise. <laughs> we don't have to go. I'll take the car back tomorrow and then we'll just go Monday. Is that okay? Huh? Okay. Is that you wanna drive? You wanna come out and let you drive? And you drive us back? Okay. Just I just, what? I just like, it's just Are you so hot. You want me to turn the AC on? The yeah, turn the AC on, please. And I feel really. <sighs> not so much, not so much. I'm just gonna turn it down a little bit. You okay? You feel it? Just need to breathe. You'll be alright, baby. <laughs> You'll be fine. You'll be just alright. I promise. I'll take the car back tomorrow, okay? I don't want you to freak out. Okay, because every time I'm in the car, you in the car. So if you don't if you don't like it, I don't like it. Okay? We'll take it back. Is that okay? Okay. Alright? Okay. You wanna drive us back or you wanna or you wanna drive back? 
You go drive back. I think I, I think I feel a little bit better right now. Okay. You sure? I don't want you to panic. If you're gonna panic, then that's it. I'll let you drive. Okay, but you gotta take it easy though. You gotta relax. I'm trying to relax, but it's like every time I look in the mirror, it's like I see the car, like the end of the car is like right here to my back, and then every time I look in the back seat, it's like no space for nothing. Like the like like look right here, like I don't know, my car was bigger than this though, like room. Room wise. It was bigger. It was bigger. It is it is gonna take some getting used to. I understand that, but I just don't want you to panic. Okay? You okay? I think I'm okay. You sure? You alright? Yeah. Yeah. I feel okay. Okay? Yeah. Alright, let's go. But I have something to tell you. Huh? I have something to tell you. What? It was I just wanted to see your reaction. See my reaction? What the, what? what do you mean? To like me, me? Yeah, like to me having like a little panic attack in the car. And I have the camera on. Are you kidding me, Brittany? <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> listen, I knew that this was going to be perfect because, <laughs> listen, and since we got into the car, when we first got in the car, I was like, Rayon, whoa, this thing is tight. And he knows I'm claustrophobic, but just because I know that he wants to drive a Camaro so bad, it's like I'm putting up with it. But! Guys, this car is tight. Oh, you got me though, you got me. I got you? You got me, because from the first day we was like, whoa, this shit's kind of tight though. Because the shovel came in the, <laughs> in the trunk. Guys, this, I don't know. Guys, I showed it to y'all, this thing is tight. Like, yeah. nobody can't even fit in that back seat. My water bottle can't even sit in the front. God this damn. thing is tight, but I got you. You did. Come you on, did. just say Team Brittany. Let me up. You did. You, did, you, you did your thing. Team Brittany. You did your thing, it's still Team Ryan, but you did your thing. That me, why you keep on trying to give me a high five? Oh. I don't want the ring to hit me. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know the thing is ice down. You know the thing is ice down. I'm trying to dig my whole hand. Come on, don't do that. This thing is ice down. But anyway, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Good. This that video was, was hilarious. That was good. That was clever. It was clever, right? I feel like I, I feel like I killed it. I feel like I did it. Because you you do be panicking though, like when you're in like small tight space, like especially in the elevator, guys. Anytime yeah. in the elevator and the elevator is not moving, open the door, open the door. <laughs> <laughs> the guys, I get very very claustrophobic. I am very very claustrophobic. I get car sick, all that kind of stuff, and I feel like every time I do it, Rayon thinks that it. Like he be so worried. I feel like he feel like I go on like I don't know. You be scared? I just be worried for you, bro. Remember the train station? Remember the train? Calm, when you first had to take me to Brooklyn on the subway? Yes. Whew. That was the worst experience. This girl never wanted to sit down. Like, it was the worst. We already started to take a bottle of water with him just so I could be calm. I used to have to like, sometimes there was no, there was no chair, so like I would have to stand up, guys. It was just a bad experience, okay? It was just bad. All right, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys like, comment, share, and subscribe. Make sure you guys turn your post notifications so you know every single time we drop a banger. And make sure you guys follow us on TikTok and all of our social medias. It'll be down below. This is good. This is good. I like this one. I like this one. Yeah, Kyle, cool. Look at that. Nice and easy. All right, guys, until next time. Peace. Uh, I was about to drop the top back in the winter. <laughs> <laughs>